Hey, Joe Weaver reporting to us that more than 90 of the sleek, modern vehicles will be put into service in this area. The first new bus designed since 1959 crashed through a paper barrier this morning at GMC Truck and Coach in Pontiac. The band played California Here I Come as the new RTS headed for GM's first customer, the Long Beach Transportation Company. GMC poured $50 million into plant and equipment changes, automated the line with robot welding equipment to piece together the six modules with the front and rear sections of the new bus. GMC General Manager Bob Truxell calls the RTS bus the beginning of a new era in bus transportation. It has many features uh, aesthetically as, as well as uh, cost-effective features that keep the life cycle cost down to a, to a minimum. Uh, things uh, such as uh, fiberglass side panels, which uh, resist the uh, graffiti, and uh, cantilever seats, which uh, improve our safety and make it uh, more easily easy to clean the uh, the bus. And of course, we have a, an all stainless steel structure, which is uh, very corrosion resistant and of course uh, a high strength. So the floor is uh, starts out at 32 inches, and we have a kneeling feature that will uh, lower it uh, five additional inches to 27 inches. Well, what's that for? For handicapped? Uh, right, this is to uh, improve the accessibility for the elderly and the handicapped, as well as all the other riders. It also has half-inch thick plastic windows and indestructible fiberglass side panels. GMC is building the RTS to fill some 800 orders from major cities around the country, but Truxell says he sees some problems ahead. The RTS exceeds federal standards, which means that it costs more than competitive models. And the federal law now requires cities buying these buses to take the lowest effective bid. So GMC either has to pressure the Urban Mass Transit Administration in Washington to change the rules or wind up eating the cost themselves. And Truxell says that's an impossibility. I'm Joe Weber, TV2 News, Pontiac. The people at GMC think one key factor in making public transportation pay for itself is in attracting more riders. And they are hopeful that the new sleek design of the RTS bus will get more people to leave their cars at home.